Welcome back to the channel. Today we are reviewing from the Toys R Us Network Spotlight series. Hunter Hearst Helmsley. Or, as most people know him, Triple H. So let's actually get into it. Starting with the accessories you do get with the set. You do get a nice looking cane. It's got a nice, if I can get it in focus. Let's move Hunter out of the way. And then it could, could properly. Nice detail on the horse head. I don't know what's happening with that. Why is it? Why has it gone all fuzzy on my end? My end. For some reason it's got all fuzzy. But let's get into the other accessory in this set. Is this nice soft goods. Jacket. Because look at that, it feels amazing. Do you like the feeling of it? And it does come with sticky, so it does stick. And boom, there you are, hunter jacket. Does feel great. And then you've got Hunter Hearst Helmsley himself. An amazing head scan of this Hunter Hearst Helmsley. Fed head face, head on the shoulder. But even with the back, I do like this. Again, I wish it was clipped onto the figure, like. Isn't like how they do with that Brock Lesnar really. That's just come out recently. But I'm going to be mentioning a lot. <laughs> with uh, these type of figures. Until they do a lot. Oh. Of course. Old Matelli. So you do have no double joint elbows. And the old elite classic syndrome of. Fist and Mike Holder. Gear. You do have the nice red. Between the legs. Like he had normally. Right. Nice white and black boots. A nice belt buckle. I would like them to nowadays, even if it was in the Legends series or something, I would like them to do another Hunt Her Soundsley. It's just to show you what this guy looks like with the cane and jacket on. And I'll give you this guy's final rating. My one do complaint though with these jackets. Is where you have so much fabric on these figures, it does get stuck, as you see there. And then we get the cane. So you can either have it at the top end as he's actually walking down to the ring, or you could have him use it as a weapon. Just have him hold it like that, and then just go smack somebody with it. But anyways, I would give this a this figure a solid. I'd give it a nine out of ten. If they clipped it at the back, as you see there, so it doesn't move as much. And if they gave him a stuck of rope proper, I do like the sticky, but I wish it didn't get stuck as much. That's why I would like to see him do another figure. I'd also like to see him do it with an inflatable head. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you like and subscribe. I hope to see you all in the next video. Thank you and goodbye.